What's going on everyone, Devin here, welcome back. So I was recently designing my new website and I was trying to research what would be the best platform to build it on. I've been using Weebly for five years now with three different websites because it's just so easy to use, but there are a lot of downfalls to it. Most creatives are using Squarespace and at first glance they're very similar. They're both drag and drop website builders with a large amount of visual first themes and as a videographer I really wanted to put an emphasis on video and images and with Weebly, I haven't been totally happy over the years. To me, my websites have just always been missing those few details that separate it from an amateur looking site to a professional crisp looking gallery. So keep in mind, I am looking at this strictly from a creative standpoint. That might not be the best for your needs. Weebly is extremely easy to use and enables you a lot of SEO options because of the large amount of apps in the marketplace. And Weebly is also a bit cheaper with starter websites coming in at just $8 a month I've been using the pro option, which is $12 a month. On the other hand, Weebly has some design limitations and the editor isn't the most in-depth. For one, and this is one of the biggest pains to me, Weebly doesn't even have an undo button. If you make a mistake or you wanna make a change, you can't even do that. The most basic of a command isn't even an option. So say your page gets deleted or changed completely, you're out of luck. Your only option is to just completely redesign your page. That is insane. My girlfriend who manages website builds recently watched me editing a page and she just couldn't believe how clunky and unintuitive it seemed. Being a long time Weebly user, I just looked right past it and I just accepted it and said, that's just how it is. Until I started using Squarespace about three weeks ago. Squarespace is known for its beautifully designed websites, which is the biggest thing for me but they are slightly more expensive and they don't feature an app store. To me, it was slightly harder to use at first, but after the first day or two, it's just as easy as Weebly. It even has groundbreaking features like an undo option. I could tell right away that my website was gonna look more like I've always wanted it to, more crisp, more visual, and overall just better laid out. There isn't an app store, but it seemed like most of the important stuff that I was looking for was already included and all the apps on the Weebly store cost extra money anyways. One thing that I was slightly disappointed to find out was that Squarespace doesn't offer phone support while Weebly does. And this is actually one of the things that I liked most about Weebly was just how great their support system was over the phone option is always, always a big help. With plans starting at $12 a month, I opted for the $18 a month business option, which is about $216 per year. For the first year, that includes your domain and a professional email, which are both a necessity. However, with the Honey add-on, I was able to find 20% off coupon, which took over $43 off my order, bringing it to about $172 a month, which is, <laughs> which brought my order to about $172, which is just $14 a month. That's not an ad for Honey either. Overall, they're both very close and Weebly is slightly easier to use, but at least for more room for error if you aren't a web designer. Minor mistakes can make your website looking very amateur and unrefined. It's also more cost effective. That includes a free option, which Squarespace does not. So if you're just creating a website for general use, then Weebly might be your best option. However, if you work in any kind of creative industry or need a more refined website for your portfolio, then Squarespace is just worth the extra money. Hope this helps a bit when making your decision what website builder to use. Anyways, that's gonna do it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't yet. I post videos just like this every Tuesday. We'll see you in the next one.